You know, I hear quite often, I've read quite often, it's just a shame that there is no guidebook to life. I mean, wouldn't that be nice? And the truth of the matter is that there's tons of guidebooks, you know, how to lose weight, how to get rich quick, how to kill a rat with an oboe, whatever. I mean, there's, you could go to any bookstore in America and find, uh, are there still bookstores? I don't know. You could find 30 books on wealth with ease. Barnes and, no, what is that called? Yeah, Barnes and Noble. Go to Barnes and Noble. They have whole sections. How to increase your memory. How to deal with your marriage and on and on and on. Well, it's just a shame that there is no guidebook for life. The trouble with that is they've clearly never heard of the book of Proverbs. I was sitting in the front yard doing my earthing. I'm taking that serious, man, because I'm seeing positive positive benefits. Can't stress that to you enough. You do what you want to do. I'm just saying. I'm not going to lie about it. There's there's times, sometimes I'll sit out there and read. Uh, sometimes I just, you know, if there's a good wind, I kind of tend to look at the, at the trees and whatnot. Sometimes that 30 minutes, I've dedicated myself 30 minutes to doing that. I don't touch the phone. That's a whole electromagnetic, electric, uh, sparkly magic. So I don't touch that. I'm just doing the earthing thing. And sometimes that 30 minutes can get, you know, by the end of it, I am checking the phone. I do set the, the timer on it and I set it beside me and I don't mess with it again. But when it gets to, you know, my butt starts getting sore. I sit on a stump out there, a wood stump. that. I... So I'll check the phone. How much time is left here? It seems like I've been out here for like almost an hour. And sometimes the, the time will drag a little bit. Well... I was reading a book a little bit ago, you know, and reading the book of Proverbs. And it dawned on me, that is the guidebook for life. How many topics do you want to know about? Chances are they're in that book. How to deal with loose women or not to. How to deal with your marriage. How to deal with your finances. How to get wealth. How to keep wealth. How to increase your wealth. What, how many more do you need? How to deal in business. How to not deal in business. How to not deal with evil and corrupt individuals. How to not deal with liars. Why you shouldn't. I mean, how many topics, how many topics in your life do you come in contact with? Well, all of them. Well, it turns out that it's all in there, man. How to be humble, why you shouldn't be boastful, how to deal with pride and arrogance and what's wrong with those things, how to deal with your neighbors, how to deal with an angry man. How long do I have to go on? If you need a guidebook for life, I'm, I'm not really one to push my personal beliefs I hate the word religion, spiritually, whatever word you want to use. I'm not really one to push my own things on someone else. But I'm telling you, if you're looking for a way, maybe you didn't have a dad in your life or some kind of mentor figure that could step in and fill that role for you. Maybe you just lost. Just, you know, I don't know how to deal with this stuff. I've never entered into business before. Or I've never... Met this guy talks a good game, but I'm, I, I got this hunch that something isn't right and I don't know what to do and I don't have anybody to ask. There is a fair to Midland or better chance that the answer is in the book of Proverbs. I'm just trying to help, man. It's right after the book of Psalms and right before the book of Ecclesiastes. Both well worth reading. I'm just saying more to the point. The book of Proverbs is the instruction manual. If ever you needed one, if ever you are looking for one, or maybe just one topic out of the thousands and thousands that a man or woman comes across just living life. It got written out. Really smart guy did it. I mean, I highly encourage you to use all the resources at your disposal.
And you'll be amazed at what you find. Just trying to help. I thank you for watching. I do appreciate your time, and I'll see you next time.